it proved to be a violent holiday here in the Circle City. Four people have been shot since 9 p.m. After a bout of hardly any crime, our Nico Panisi is live from IMPD headquarters this morning with the very latest on those shooting investigations. Nico, good morning. Good morning, Caitlin. The overnight shootings are a stark contrast from the hardly any violence that happened over the weekend. We'll begin with a shooting on Indy South Side. IMPD says that officers responded to Hannah Avenue and Independence Drive at around 1230 this morning. And when officers arrived, they found a man who'd been shot. EMS took him to the hospital in critical condition. IMPD says there's no known danger to the community at this time. And Captain Rob Ryder says it's still early in the investigation and Metro Police are actively working to learn more. The investigators are still trying to determine exactly uh, what, what took place and where exactly it, it occurred at. And violence struck other areas of the city too. Just before 10 Monday night, IMPD says a person was shot at the 5200 block of Pinebrook Drive. They were taken to the hospital in stable condition. Over on Indy South Side, IMPD responded to a report of a walk-in person shot at Community South Hospital just before 1 a.m. When officers arrived, they found a person who'd been shot and their condition is unknown at this time. Then on Indy's east side, IMPD says a person was shot at the 300 block of North Denny Street just before 2 a.m. They are at the hospital in stable condition. And these investigations are ongoing. As we learn more details from police, we'll continue to update you on air and on web with the latest. Reporting live in downtown Indianapolis this morning, Nico Panisi, WRTV.